sorry, one sec. you waiting long? Have you been here long? No? Good, good, good. Um, wow, I am out of breath. Uh, yes, so, I'm glad we're finally doing this. I know, I know, we've been talking about this for a while. Um, yeah. You know, I've been really looking forward to this. Um, so, what do you do for a living again? Right, super interesting. Right, um, I'm a personal trainer. Very big into fitness, very big into fitness. Um, yeah, well, today was my day off, so that's why I had to get in. A workout or two um, so I just thought I'd run here very big into just looking after my body taking care of myself being just like the best version of myself I can be you know so fitness is really important to me um, yeah you know, the easy run easy run the way back that'll be easy too yeah I'm actually training for a marathon right now so it's really good for me to get in any extra running when I can. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna put these off to the side. Um, no, no, I don't need, I don't need a ride home. Totally good, but that's really sweet of you to offer. Thank you. Are you into fitness? Oh. I thought your profile, yeah, online said sports, like you were into sports. I thought that meant like you were into like working out and stuff. Watching sports, gotcha. No, I'm not much of like a viewer of sports. I prefer to like actually be active and doing the sport myself, you know? Yeah. Um. But that's, that's not a big deal. I'm sure we have a lot of other things in common. Definitely, definitely. Um, fitness is my life, but that doesn't mean that, like, you know, the person that I'm looking for necessarily has to be really into fitness. I think it's sometimes good for people to have different interests, you know. I can get you into being healthy, taking care of your body, living your best and longest life, and you, it sounds like, could just help me really become more relaxed. Yeah, exactly. Maybe I'll learn to watch sports and, um, yeah, drink beer, eat wings, that type of fun um, use of my time. Yeah, no, I'm totally down to try new things. Yeah. Um, I typically don't like eating in front of the TV, even if it would be for like viewing sports, just because I like to be mindful when I'm eating and really pay attention to what I'm putting in my body. So mindlessly eating in front of the TV just like isn't really my thing, but like I said, um, relationships, well not that we're in a relationship, but it's a trying new thing, so totally. Okay, so, um, have you looked at the menu? Yes, well I have a certain amount of macros I can have per day, so yeah, so I already looked at the menu and calculated everything out as far as how many grams of fat and carbs and protein would be in each dish. 
So I'm ready when you are. Yeah, I know exactly what I'm getting. Okay. Okay, let's just see. Yeah, wave them down if you can. Yeah, just get them when the waiter's ready. Oh, I got it. Yeah, I got it. Hi. Yeah, I think we're ready to order. Do you want to go first? You go first. I go first? Okay. Okay. Okay, so... I would like a bowl of spaghetti, grilled chicken, six ounces, no seasoning, no oil, no butter, plain chicken, baked in the oven. Okay, and if you could be so kind, I don't know if your chef has a scale in the back, just to weigh out the chicken so that I know I'm getting six ounces exactly, no more, no less. Okay, you give this to the chef. Um, I apologize for the inconvenience. I just really need to watch myself right now. I am in a cutting phase right now, so I really need to watch what I'm putting in my body at this time. Yes, I cannot go over my macros, so I hope your chef will understand. I do apologize for any inconvenience. Also, let's hold the spaghetti. I brought a spaghetti squash from home. Was hoping that your chef could use this. So what you do, you can make it in the microwave, in the oven. What I like to do is you're going to slice it in half, open it up, Put a little water in a like a baking dish and you're going to put it face up in the oven for let's say 20 minutes then you're gonna scrape the inside of the squash comes out looking exactly like spaghetti but like way less way less calories so much healthier exactly I'm not trying to carb overload right now Thank you. Thank your chef for me so much. Thank you. No parmesan for the pasta. I brought my own nutritional yeast that I'll be using. Yes, and this... You don't know what nutritional yeast is? Do you know what nutritional yeast is? Guys, oh my gosh. No, seriously. It's, um, it has a cheesy taste, but it is a unique vegetarian food. I'm just reading from the back. Um, it's a unique veg vegetarian food with a pleasant cheesy flavor. It's rich in B vitamins, including B12, for a rich umami flavor, and nutri add nutritional yeast to sauces, scrambles, vegetable chips, crackers, pizza, pasta, to boost nutritional intake, and please your taste buds, sprinkle over vegetables, baked potatoes, or popcorn. This stuff is so good, guys, so good. Yeah, the nutritional benefits are so good. Thank you so much. Now your turn. Ooh, having a cocktail, are we? No, I'm all set. Thank you. I don't drink alcohol, but just a glass of sparkling water would be amazing. Thank you so much. I just want to... I need to check my fitness app. Um, ooh, I thought it was eight miles here. Apparently it was only seven. Yeah, that's not good. Um, no, it's like not horrible, but I'm just really trying to meet a certain goal every day and probably gonna have to go for an extra long run when I get back home. Um, but anyway, enough about me. Tell me more about you. So, do you work out? Mm-hmm. Three-ish times a week, not bad. Uh, what do you do? Cardio, weights? Mm-hmm. Okay. Do you do high-intensity workouts? You gotta keep that heart rate up, you know? Oh, mm. yeah, what muscle groups are you really looking to work? Okay, and what exercises do you do for that? 
pretty good. What do you eat before you go to the gym though? Because if you're really trying to build muscle, you have to make sure that you're eating high protein and between you and me what you ordered for dinner. Not that much protein in it. Yeah, no, that's not going to give you the gains that you want. Trust me. Um, so for you, personally, um, I would recommend downloading this app right here. So good for counting your macros, figuring out what workouts are best for you. You can put in your height, your weight, um, and just what you're really trying to get out of your workouts. And it'll really help you just build muscle, gain strength. So good. Oh, I love core exercises on this app. Yeah, really, really good. Um, I would totally check it out if I were you. Yeah, definitely. No, I know. Fitness is so important. Um, yeah, I don't... Sometimes I like to run with my dog. Um, sometimes I like to... I don't know. I'm more like an active person. I really hate sitting still, so I'm not really into like just like staying in and watching TV. I'd rather, you know, if I go to the beach, I'm going to be swimming in the ocean. I'm not going to be like lying on a towel getting a tan. Um, yeah, just not really my thing. You're more of like a lay down and get a tan. Gotcha. Um, yeah, I, I like, I love hiking, love camping, love hiking, really just staying active, staying moving. Yeah, it's not for everyone. I mean, you know, it's totally at that, totally at that. But I, yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Definitely, definitely. I mean... I totally get that. Sometimes you just want to stick in and chill. Um, I just really am not that into that. I just really love a good workout. I love going to the gym late. Mm, so true. Um, so what else do you have going on? in life. Wow, that is so amazing. Um, mm -hmm. Oh, cool. I'm thinking of starting my own fitness app soon. Um, I'm working on it. I've kind of been basing it off of that app I just showed you, but making it like more my own and more unique so like they can't like sue me or anything but it'll be really great um so what i'm thinking is like it'll send you a notification every morning with like your workout goals for the day it'll give you notifications about your workout goals the day before little tips about how you can increase your workouts give you um nutrition tips like you can, when you get home from the grocery store, put in the ingredients that you got at the grocery store and it can come up with like healthy ideas of what you can do with them. So based on what you have, such a good idea, right? I know. So I was going to do something like that and then also it would, um, kind of send you little motivational quotes throughout the day to uplift you and keep you going so that is really under the works right now and I want that to be go live soon I'm trying to start to like build a following based on um members at the gym where I am a personal trainer I've been really working hard to spread the word about that app that'll be coming out my gym my gym did offer to um, feature it in the newsletter that we send out once a month also thinking of opening my own gym possibly in the future long term I would love to have my own uh, brand of workout apparel workout equipment 
yes yes definitely i want everyone to just like really know how important it is to work out you know eat right and i think that through these different methods that i have i could really help change some lives no joke so is there anything um i feel like we don't have that much in common if i'm being completely honest which is totally fine but like i don't know i definitely i mean like i think a relationship can work when you have different interests but like you just don't really seem that active at all you know like i do feel like i need someone that probably is like a bit more into just like healthy living yeah no um yeah well i i think like what a person orders for dinner says a lot about them and you did pick like the fried food which is like such a no-no you know so um I can totally be your trainer, but that's probably as much as I can give you. Yeah. So, would you, what do you think? Where's my business card? Here you go. Always carry them with me whenever I see someone that looks like they're really just not taking care of themselves to the best that they can be taking care of themselves. I'm always down to just like spread my message, help people out, and really try to motivate people, you know, to be like healthier, fitter versions of themselves. So, so yeah, um, ooh, I think that's our food, but let's talk diet and workout plan for you, okay? 